It's a bird, it's a mosquito, it's the man with the jetpack, the man that's half the size of Bella Betty, the soft revolution of government and suffer, he's the cat make genius, he literally has all the chill, it's the one and only Limber. What's going on guys, you with Puraimu Ace here, man, bringing you another video. Now, today we're gonna be talking about the South Revolutionary Commander, bro. Which is Lambert. Let's get it, yo. Yeah, man, so Lambert, he's a cat mech, bro, which means that he's from Zo. And when you're from Zo and you're a mech, it means that you know Zulong transformation, which is stated that he could actually transform into a Zulong. And he also know the electricity move that Carrot used. I forgot the name of it, damn it. Yeah, he could also use that. And another thing about him, he's an inventor. He likes to invent stuff like gadget weapons, especially for battles, because he loves to fight. Now, he's, he is actually the example that I wanted Usopp to be, you know. I wanted Usopp to be just like that, you know. He loved to invent stuff like he invented the staff for Nami. For Nami. I would love for Usopp to have the same type of, you know, hype behind him. You know, like, he loves to fight, he loves to invent stuff, you know, he loves to do that. That's what I wanted Usopp to be. Now, there have been some theories with him that he's actually Dr. Vegapunk, which I don't think that is the case, because from, like, the last episode, like, two episodes ago, we saw that Greenbow, the new Admiral that we just been introduced to, he mentioned that... Vegapunk, basically the way he mentioned Vegapunk is like he's an old man. Like I'm pretty sure, cause he seems like he's a pretty straightforward guy. I'm pretty sure if he was talking about if Vegapunk was like the cat man, he would have probably be like the cat thing, like just sit there in a the lab all day. I feel like that's the way he would have probably approached it. You know, that's the kind of, kind of guy that he seems to be, not you know. In terms of his ability, really, he basically don't really have, you know, a devil fruit. I mean, not that we know of, he doesn't have any devil fruit. Like I said, he has so long transformation, um, the electricity thing that carrot use, which is basically all make use. Um, he likes to invent stuff like the, the cool shooter, I think that's what it's called. The mask for carrot suit, that he's the one that invented that. Um, and he basically have probably a lot of other toys that he could you know fight with that we haven't been introduced to i'm pretty sure about that and he is the self revolutionary commander like i said before um which means he's supposed to be strong if you're a commander in the revolutionary army like you know bella betty and carousel and that means he she should be strong uh, in terms of hockey we don't know if he has conquerors hockey but i'm pretty sure he has observation and honorary hockey like the typical ones. Another thing about him is that we we also learned that he's actually a pretty good marksman. Like he's good with his guns, you know, because he's cool shooter. We saw how he aimed precisely with it. Like he actually hit every target. So which means that he he probably would be a good sniper. Now is he like Usopp level? I don't know. Maybe, probably, but I, we don't know. I wish Usopp could really have like a real gun and stuff, you know, a slingshot. Like, if he had like a sniper, you know, that would that would really be dope. Even if it doesn't shoot like bullets, at least shoot something like you know that could hurt the enemy, like some a poison thing. Like, I, you see how he shoot his green, um, what you call it, green things that he shoot out his, out of his slingshot. At least shoot that with like a real sniper, bro. Like, I want to see some cool stuff with that instead of, you know, a slingshot. We need a real sniper in there, man. We, we, we need a real sniper, bro. Sniper, king, bro. Like, we, we need a real one in there, bro. Now, so far, that is really all we know about Lambert. Now, personally, what I'm hoping for with this character is that I want to see what he could really invent it what kind of weapon he could come up with, you know? Like, does he have also have a flamethrower? I'm pretty sure he could invent that since he invented a, a cool shooter, which is an ice gun. I'm pretty sure he has that. 
he created the jet a jetpack that's pretty cool now in one piece we have not seen a machine gun i mean we have but it's only been with caribou like that's the only machine gun we've seen but i'm talking about like uh, an ak-47 type machine gun like you know something that someone could hold with like like two hands and just aim like that he probably could invent that also now can he modify like a ship like frankie did possibly because he seems like he's, he's he's a really intelligent guy which he is you know he is an intelligent guy imagine him going into his suit on transformation right and he just creates some type of armor that you know boosts his his physical strength like three times like let's just say he create like a type of glove that you know give him some extra boost like you know to to, to that to have extreme power and some type of boots and like you know a, a chest pad or some shit like that that will give him extreme mobility now what else can he make can he make a nuclear bomb we don't know but i'm pretty sure he'll probably come close to it frankie i'm pretty sure frankie could make a jetpack also because the guy made a a ship that could fly in the sky in like less than one second and that ship is like five, 55 meters tall he made a robot so a jetpack i'm pretty sure a jetpack would have been light work but does Lindbergh and intelligent goes as far as frankie maybe we don't know but we'll see we just have to see more about him because we don't really know too much so yeah man that is it for Lambert. Please down in the comment section, let me know your thoughts, your opinion, what you want to see about him, bro. You know, personally, I want to see more of his gadgets, more of his weapons, you know. So, yeah, man, it's been your boy, Purayim, ASA, man. I'm out.